right hey guys i'm chef sunflower and today i'm going to be showing you how to make this awesome dripped out cake with like everything on it i don't even know what to call it but i'm about to show you guys how i did it but anyways let's get started let's go okay so i started this cake with three layers of a six inch cake um and pink frosting and i'm just if you want to see how I frost my cakes, you can look in any of my previous videos or my recent last video, which just shows you how I frost the cake. After I get my edges sharp and clean, I'm just going to pull my um, little goodies I made earlier out of the fridge. Um, I made three cake donuts, two cupcakes, and a big cake ball like a cake pop basically for my ice cream cone i'm gonna sit my cake ball on top and then i'm just gonna pour my chocolate drip all over my cake ball just making sure i cover up everything and then i'm gonna drip some off the sides um for this i use candy melts and a little bit of water and i just colored it with some pink dye if you want to know the recipe for that i'll put a little description below for you guys after I do that I'm just gonna put a couple sprinkles on top and then I'm gonna get my ice cream cone I'm so sorry I didn't get a better shot of this but I'm just putting the frosting in my ice cream cone at the top and I'm just gonna stick it on to my ball and with that chocolate and the frosting I'm going to put this in the fridge and when it freezes up, it's just going to make it all stick together. So I got my cake donuts here and I'm just going to spice them up and put a little white drip on them, trying to make them look more cartoony, more Simpson-y. And after I put my chocolate drip on, I'm going to finish it off with some more sprinkles. Because we love sprinkles here. So pretty. They're so cute. I love that. I love those cake donuts. So anyway, um, I'm going to place them on my cake. This is the cake after it came out the fridge. I just let it sit in the fridge for like five to ten minutes. Not long. And uh, I'm just going to place some of my donuts on there. I wasn't really sure how I was going to place my donuts, so you'll see me moving them around a lot. But eventually, they find a place. I'm trying to create like some height so I ended up stacking my donuts on top of each other and I moved this one and I put it on top and I think that looked better so I could put my cupcake right here on the front yeah I like that so I got a bag with half purple and half pink frosting in it and I'm just gonna make a swirl on top of my cupcake right here Ooh. <laughs> So I'm going to put little spurts of the frosting everywhere just to jazz it up a little bit because it was looking a little plain to me. So I put a little couple, couple of those things everywhere and I had extra frosting so why not. Party over here, party over there. And then I just topped it off with some sprinkles but the frosting on the uh, the ice cream cone wasn't looking good to me, so I ended up smoothing that in with a spatula. And it looked more like melted ice cream. To me, it looked kind of better, so <laughs> I think that came out pretty good. So I just smoothed it all out, and I just put some more sprinkles on top. And it really looked more melted, if that even makes sense. But I loved it. <laughs> I loved it. Um, but I still wasn't satisfied, so I ended up making some buttercream lollipops with the same frosting I used. Um, I made three, but I only ended up using one because I was just going a little crazy. And I put one at the back. That one I did not end up using. You're going to see me end up taking that off. But, yeah. And I also ended up putting um, a little cupcake on the side there <laughs> also added that the other cupcake I put it on the side I cut it in half put it on the side and yeah I frosted and put some sprinkles 
and this was the end result you guys so tell me what you think i absolutely fell in love with this cake and my clients have been asking me for more like buttercream girly cake so this was for my clients this is for you guys you know just to give you guys some diversity so yeah tell me what you think in the comments below thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel for more cake trends and more girly cakes bye